Guys, welcome back to the show. You're back on the Ernst and George show. We have another awesome, positive filled episode for you. Now, this show is super important for people to be mindful in their daily lives of something that I would say 99.4 to 99.6% of all people do, have done, continue to do, and continue to do in spite Cut. of knowing. What? Get into the meat. Okay, go. Wait, how's it look? How's it look? How's it look? Are we cutting? No, we're not cutting. I just wanted to tell you about my hair. How is my hair today? I took extra time making sure it was right for us. That does not sound right, <laughs> but... Okay, guys. It is Seriously. okay. Let's get back into this, baby. We're getting back into this. The hair is fine. It'll do for today. Now, what are we talking about? What is something that 99.4 to 99.6% This is an extra statistic, by the way. We need to look it up. Yes. That's what, he loves statistics. He's always throwing them out there. Um, because I want statistics to back up what my opinions of things. You know, what, what I observe in life. And then I go and check it out. And I'm like, hey. We are talking about. I'm not that strange. I know what I'm talking about. Gossiping. People that just love to talk about other people. Especially in a negative way. In a negative way. Gossiping, I don't think can there's really a, be done in a positive a difference, way. There's a difference between gossiping about people and edification of people. When you herald someone, when I, you edify I speak, them. I speak about Ernst a lot because I really do look up to this guy. And, and I really do believe that he's going to go very, very far in life. So I do speak very positively. He positive knows what he's him. talking about, people. I do. I do. <laughs> I meet enough people to know some will make it and... Some won't, uh, but I do speak about him a lot. I can honestly tell you, I don't, I don't find anything negative to say about him. Now, why am I? Why do we want to touch on negative? Except that I fail to compliment his hair in a timely manner sometimes. Yeah. One of these days, I'm just gonna <laughs> smack him as soon as I walk into the video, and then he's gonna go, oh, 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 you know, or maybe I'll mess up his hair, and then he'll remember to talk about, oh, that's what I'm gonna do. Next time I'll mess up his hair, my and he'll remember to talk about my hair. Un mess up, mess up a bowl. <laughs> I wake up like this, guys. It's like a my, helmet. My hair wakes I, it up. It never like changes. That. Anyway, guys, it it is like a helmet. <laughs> it's it's like a helmet. protects my brain against the negative bullshit out there. <laughs> okay, so guys, please stop listening to people who gossip about other people. Don't gossip. Don't let people who gossip uh, make you an outlet for them. Yep. Don't let them take up your precious time. This don't become time you the can't sink. Get back. Don't become the sink to their water spout of gossip. But here's my here's my reason why I, we wanted to talk about this one today, uh, because my father told someone to leave his house today, and my father very rarely kicks people out of the house. He kicked someone out of the house today. It was a visitor. And the person's always coming and knocks on the door. My father, my parents live in a, in a condo complex. And um, they live on the first floor. And it seems like everybody who's going up or down the stairs always have to stop by and say hi and talk. Well, there's this lady that always stops by to complain about everybody in the building. And say, and give gossip about everybody in the building. And gossip about this one. And apartment this and that and this and that. And my father today told her, listen, I have to tell you, you have to go. You have to stop coming here. You're going to talk about our neighbors. I don't want to know about it. And my father, right in front of... And I was there, so I heard this. Right in front of me tells her, the reason why I don't want to listen to your gossiping about apartment this and unit that and this person and that person and this person's kid is because I know that as soon as you leave my place, you're going to go to those same places and you're going to complain to them about us. If I give you an audience... To listen to you speaking badly about other people, then I have no reason later to come and confront you when you say something wrong about us. I don't want you talking about us to the neighbors, and I don't want you to talk to us about our neighbors. That's not what we're here for. Get out, and when you're ready to come in here like a positive person and contribute in a positive way, then we can talk. Yeah. I've never seen my father do this. Never. But he's just so tired of the constant gossiping. Don't do it and don't give people an audience to do it because then you can't complain 
when they do and it, you become you. an accessory to it. Yes, oh, good word. They're very unattractive trade people. Yes, don't do it. Someone who's truly success minded, mm -hmm. goal oriented, will not allow gossiping in their environment no, really? because that kills dreams and visions because it's a very low energy thing to do. We don't have the time for it anyway. I'm too busy to listen to we your We don't have the time. If you're working 12 hours a day minimum. Yeah, guys. Which you, all of you should be doing if you aspire to success. If you're building your own, your own future, yes. do it. But guys, <clears throat> we don't have, I don't have the time to listen about what that lady's son did two Sundays ago in Forest Park and this is what he was... I don't have the time. So, and, and that's just it, guys. You have to decide. Time is the most important thing in your life because it's the only thing you can't get back. Yep. Once it's spent, right now, I just spoke right now, I just spent that time. I can't take it back. It's done. It's gone. It's in the past already. That sentence is in the past. Everything's in the past already. I don't want to... Con Give away my time to someone who's going to tell me about this person's kid who did that over there two Sundays give ago in the park. energy and focus. Guys, whatever, care. You, whatever you give your focus to and your energy to grows. Yes. So that will grow. That problem will grow. So stop gossiping people and the don't moral, let people gossip. The moral of the story, wrapping it up, the moral of the story is if you are a gossiper, if you engage in gossiping and this video did not change your mind about gossiping, please give us a dislike. <laughs> He's going to pitch dislikes every day now. <laughs> now, if you are a gossiper, <clears throat> you were a gossiper, and now you decide that you are going to be an ex-gossiper, and you're going to be more aware You've of been what saved. you're talking about. Yeah, if we have converted you to come to the... Non-gossip zone. Well, this is actually the dark side, because most people are gossipers. Yeah. If you come to the dark side of the non-gossipers, guess what? Like, you can go ahead and allow yourself to like our video. Yes. We allow you to do that. Yes. And we let's welcome become, you to do that. And let's become friends because we want to talk to you since you have no time to talk about someone else in a negative way. Now, do talk to us about good people. Do share good people with us. And if you're a good we person, we want to hear from you as yes, well. Yes, guys. Love you guys. Stay busy, stay positive, stop allowing gossip in your life. Your time is better and worth more than that. All right? He knows what he's talking about. Talk to you guys soon. Stop it. <laughs>